Good morning to the great people of God. This is your homeboy, Pastor Earl, coming at you live and direct from Abyssinian Baptist Church in the Windy City of Whitehaven. This is indeed the day that the Lord has made, and I am going to rejoice and be glad in it. Today is Sunday, April the 13th, and I am coming at you with your God moment, the gospel on deck moment, where we try to share some things that we expect and anticipate God is going to do in and through Abyssinian Missionary Baptist Church on this Lord's Day. Today is Palm Sunday. So even right now, we are uh, celebrating through some transformative teaching that is taking place in our Sunday school hour that is already underway. But our worship service is uh, so sure to be power-packed and uh, faith-filled. So I am hyped to be back in the saddle. I've been out of Abyssinian this past, I was out of Abyssinian this past Sunday. And so I'm glad to be back right here again. Uh, and so the God moment today is simply that I will be preaching from Matthew chapter 21, verse 6 through 11, where I am titling the sermon, Don't Mess Around and Miss Him. So many of us know that Palm Sunday is the Sunday where we celebrate what is known as the triumphal entry of Jesus into Jerusalem and it begins Holy Week. Well, what many people do not know is that when Jesus made it into town, there were some people who were wondering who he is. So in the book of Matthew around chapter 21 verse 6, somebody started saying, who is this? And I just want to lift up how we live in a world of prejudice and stereotypes such that we expect to be able to read and anticipate who somebody is and how somebody is just up on a cursory glance. But Jesus shows up and Jesus pulverizes prejudice and Jesus shatters stereotypes. So I'm glad that there were some people asking who was this because the God that I serve is not easily legible to everybody. It's not easy to read God sometimes. God does some unconventional stuff in some unconventional ways. But whenever God shows up, God shows up with power whether we honor that power or not. So I just don't want any of us to mess around and miss the manifestation of a Messiah in our lives simply because we're caught up in bias, bigotry, prejudice, and stereotypes. So don't mess around and miss them. I'm going to try to share with uh, the Abyssinians today one of the ways in which you can ensure that you don't miss God if and when God shows up. So that's what we're looking forward to, some awesome singing some powerful prayers uh, if the Lord says the same some prophetic preaching and so uh, if you have time we want you to make it by Abyssinian 3890 Mill Branch this morning and if not there are some other things that are going on this week that we want to invite you to I will be teaching uh, at the Whitehaven Baptist Congress on Christian education this week that will be held at Middle Baptist on Whitehaven Lane in Whitehaven. I'll be teaching a class entitled Christianity and Digital Discipleship. So I'll be talking about what it means to actively live out of faith in the 21st century, even on social media. But not only that, there are some wonderful Good Friday Seven Last Word services going on in the city of Memphis. And I have been invited to one. So on this upcoming Friday, April the 18th, uh, I will be at New Friendship Missionary Baptist Church sit on Silver and Gold sharing in the Seven Last Word service. So there are so many fantastic things that are going on in the life of Abyssinian Baptist Church. And I am glad that what God is doing in this season, God is not forgetting about us. So won't you do, do me a favor? Why don't you meet me at ABC? Peace.